Good morning, Tyra fam. I hope you are all doing well. I have just dropped off Iris and Olive at my mum's. It is now 25 past 11, so we have quite a chunk of time before I need to pick up Max from his last day at football school. That's at three o'clock. Then pick up the girls. Jude is spending the day with a friend. So I just have Jeannie Weenie and Hi. Elsie Belsie with me and we have a list all written down everything that we want to achieve and I'm thinking that we um, should be able to do it in record time because we have the best of the best of the best sir in yeah. this car is that right girls yeah yeah, yeah? so we're gonna be in and out as quickly as we possibly can we're going to be very efficient with our time and get everything done yeah yeah and there's not going to be any crying moaning fighting <laughs> not even i don't i don't even want you to need the toilet well, you're, gonna need the toilet. you're gonna have to sweat it out instead oh yeah nice. <laughs> right you ready yeah so the first port of call is the library yeah. and elsie's complaining aren't you yeah because this is so heavy these books you have to be strong, else. I know, they're literally so heavy, the books are so heavy. Are you going to sign up for the summer reading yeah, challenge? Really yeah, yeah. Okay. And when I was younger, I'd take like six books. How and many I books is it, Jean? How many books is it you've got to read for the summer reading challenge? Six. Okay, I think you can do it. Yeah, I think you can do it. So let's see if we can sign up. Yeah. Are you getting any books out today? Yeah, probably. Are you, Jean? Are you getting any books out? Um, yeah, if I can find some, I want. Every time I come here, this gets more and more like technical, don't you think? Return. Oh, that bag already. How did it scan that already when it's not even out of the bag? <laughs> So guys, I just signed up for the summer reading challenge. You have to read six books in six weeks. Yeah, I was gonna do it this year, but like I just don't really feel like doing it. But we do really need to get Max yeah. doing it because I need to encourage him a lot more to read. So I think if he, he had a challenge, a yeah, he would complete it. But like I, last year I done it, but then I didn't complete it. I didn't read six books. I read like yeah. half of one book. Yeah, so you really need to complete yeah, it this I'm year. Yeah, I'm gonna really try to complete it this year. I've already got two books. I've got Flying High and Midnight Beast. <laughs> And Elsie also got her first library yeah. card, guys. I used to always use Mum's library card, but now I've got my own one. Oh, and guys, I'm gonna get this book out. It's called Little Men. It is a follow-on of Little Women, and guys, I love Little Women so much, so I cannot wait to read this. Guys, comment down below if your local library is doing anything like this, because I think it's a really, really good idea because it gets loads more kids yeah. reading, doesn't it? So, yeah, we're just gonna go and check out our books now. Guys, Elsie was so confused of how you get books out from the library. She had no idea where you put the library card or anything. Okay. Okay, to press finish now. <laughs> it's not called the entertainer anymore. The toy, no, it, it's a toy shop. It's called the toy shop. No. Oh no, it is called the entertainer. <laughs> I thought it was just called the toy. Oh, en the entertainer, the toy shop. Right, I want to go in there. I want these water balloons. Yeah, you can fill a hundred in sixty seconds because it all goes in together and then you tie them off. Oh, so no. it looks good. So we get two hundred. Yeah? Okay, yeah, for a big fight. Yeah. You ready? I hate no, no. Yeah, we won't let him. We're having. We're gonna. We're gonna do something special with them. I've got a plan. Water bomb plan. No, all of us together. Fun, fun, fun. So Jean needs to choose two whole new pairs of glasses. Yeah, you get the whole thing again. So you're gonna have four pairs, but two of them are broken anyway. So it doesn't really matter. So yeah. But the thing is, don't you think the choosing process just takes so long? There's just so many. Yeah, that's nice. They're purpley pink. Try them on. They're nice. They're more of the shape of your second pair, aren't they? Don't you think? I like them, but I just don't want glasses. You don't, well, you know, I think the thicker frame ones suit you. Um, like, try on a thin one and see. I think they look quite fragile, don't you? I hate glasses. Let's have a look. They look all right. They look all right. Yeah, yeah, them bits are uncomfortable. Your ones don't have it, do they? Just have a plastic bit. They look quite big. <laughs> Large. Oh, hello, Professor Elsie. Hello. I think you should get ones like Professor Trelawney, Jean. No, they magnify them. Yeah. They magnify them. Is it waves? 
quite fancy. Ginny, are you just playing games? No, I'll pick some. Yeah, pick some that you might actually consider buying. Okay. Be like these ones. Oh, they're really nice. I haven't seen them ones, have I? Um, no, those ones are bottom. Oh, they're Spanish. nice. Really they're nice. nice. I think yeah. I get these. Jean asked Elsie to hold her glasses, and this oh, is what yeah, she did. Will... Yeah, with your books. Hands so she's holding them both. <laughs> Which one are you going to go for, Jean? I think I probably am going to get the red ones. Yeah. yeah. Really but you need two. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, you need I two. Pick one of those two. Oh, okay before Elsie breaks them. Right, hold the red ones for her. I like both jeans, so you just go, you just you just choose one. I don't think it matters. Then they're different, why don't you get them? Just get them, just make the decision. Oh yeah, honey bun. Elsie's getting an early start on her books. Page one, chapter one, day one. Why are you pretending you can read, Elsie? I can read. <laughs> Stop Wait, does that say obediently? Yes, it does. So you can't read. Obediently. Do you know what that means? It means to be a good little girl. Um, are you a good little girl? Sometimes. Oh, mummy loves you. After much searching, guys, we found some orange lollies for Elsie. Yeah. Um, because she cannot have these vegan cornettos because they contain hazelnut bits. So she's feeling a bit upset about that because we get ice cream, you get lolly, but the lollies look really nice. Yeah, They're like the. I love orange lollies. Um, Del Monte's really nice, I think. I like that the, they do like fruit pots. You know the little pineapple pots and things that you used to like? Do you remember? Oh, yeah, I think I remember. Yeah, so uh, it's 100% so juice. Oh. What are you having? I'm having one of these. I'm having an ice cream too. Oh. Then we are going to go pick up your jazz shoes. And then, guys, guess what? We have achieved everything in a much shorter amount of time than we would have done. But I'm kind of missing the babies, so I have got something super fun planned for when they come home. Something to do with babies, water bombs, water, uh. <laughs> garden, trampoline. If you put all of those things together, what picture conjures up in your head? I think an absolutely crazy, yeah. wet, messy yeah, one. Definitely. But yeah, well, I miss them. I don't miss them. Yeah, I miss them, so I want to create some fun for them. I mean, I'm sure they're having fun at Nana's anyway. You know, can you open it for me? Oh yeah, sorry. Thank you. And then you can you can be the um, carrier of cold things. How cold is it in these shops? It's crazy. No, like honestly, Tesco and Sainsbury's. They're like not just like nicely cold. They are like the Arctic Circle, like aren't they? Like, well, we can't, like, oh. <laughs> yeah, really not. No, it's uncomfortable. Yeah. Jean, you litterer. Yeah. So we have completed everything in like record time, yeah, don't you think? So yes. Oh, look at that, guys. No, Elsie, don't get too close. You might go into anaphylaxis shock. Elsie, honestly, I've got two EpiPens in my bag. I'm ready, girl. They carry EpiPens around everywhere, and I don't really. Yeah. So we can walk up to the shoe shop leisurely with our cold things, and um, yeah, we've achieved everything, and it's been quite calm, hasn't it? Gee, <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? Yeah. So uh, at least we got everything done. Hey. Yeah. Should we cut walking? Oh, Elsie was asking us to go on these like aeroplanes over there, guys. Yeah. She's like, Mum, can me and Jean go on the aeroplanes? Yeah, I don't want to go on. Elsie. Can I go on? No. Okay? Not this time. Okay, can you go okay. next time? Maybe, maybe. maybe. Mummy does love you, doesn't she? Yeah. Come on then. Good girl. Good girl. You right, Jean? Yeah. Jean, are you embarrassed of us? Are you embarrassed of me? Sometimes. Oh. Are you? Ridiculous in public. <laughs> I, I, do, I don't care about public, do I? I just feel like I'm alone and I just do whatever all the time. Let's have a look. Oh, it looks amazing. Look, it's so bright. I can't even see you. What's going on? We're in a dome. Oh, look, let me unzoom it. What's it like? Is it nice? Our one's like comparison in size, actually. I thought yours was way bigger. Jean, not too close. Nuts. Oh, she haven't got socks. She might have some, so you could try them on. I think you're supposed to wear no, socks are, with um, jazz shoes. Most no shoes, really. Oh. Oh. Can you actually walk in those shoes that we got yesterday? Yes. Are you sure, Elsie? Yeah. So we are all done now guys, we've had a very productive day. We are all just going to shoot off to Max's football um, camp because they are holding a little presentation because it's the last day today. 
So I have just picked up this little champion from his summer football camp. They had a little presentation where they gave all the children like a certificate. Yeah. But Max was a little bit upset because they gave them all um, water bottles, but they've all got like Chelsea's Everything's emblem on them. Everything's got Chelsea on it. Like every single thing is Chelsea. He got a Chelsea pin. He got a Chelsea magazine. He got like a Chelsea certificate. Everything was Chelsea, wasn't it? Yeah. But you did really enjoy it, didn't you? Yeah, it was really, really fun. Yeah, you made lots of friends as well, didn't you? Yeah, I made three friends. Ooh. Three friends. Well done. And anyway, so at the end of like the main presentation, they gave out some awards for like some exceptional players. Um, now, the man started talking about a little boy who like came in quiet, but at the end was like the life and soul. He made everybody smile. He was really smiley himself. They said that this person took on board all of their... Um, teachings and made some great improvements was really willing to learn and i just i just knew i just knew that it was going to be max and he went and this goes to max so max has come home with the most improved player of the whole squad so i am so incredibly proud of you did you think it was going to be you when he was talking about no, it I, I didn't you had no it. idea no, no. it sounds he, he literally described max to a T, so yeah. I, I have a smiley face. Yeah, and you make everybody else smile, and you yeah. make them smile. They said you were a great player, and you did really well, and you're a great team player, so yeah. I also just went and picked up Olive and Iris from my mum's, and um, you have got cheer, haven't you? You and Jean have got cheer at five o'clock. I'm hoping to get in a little water play fun that I have had planned since this morning. I always have like crazy plans and I try and fit in far too much into my day but I am going to go and try and get the ball rolling now so that everyone can join in and then um, get these guys to cheer at five. Hopefully I am not cutting it too fine. So do you guys remember these that I bought earlier? I think there's like um, 100 per pack and I got two packs. So what hasn't already burst is now laying in weights in the trampoline filled with water. And the plan being, I'm going to get the girls to get on there and see if they can stomp them all out um, and just have some fun. Mummy has filled the trampoline with water balloons yeah. and I want you and Ollie to get on there and see if you can pop them with your feet. Do you want to give it a go? Do you want to give it a go, Ollie? Go on then, you can get on. Oh, she's not actually, oh, my dad's too to get on. Let's see. Oh! <laughs> Let's see what you... The thing is, Max, you'd probably have it over with in, like, seconds. I, I want to see... Ah! Oh, it's got a lot on mummy! Let's see how well they can do on their own for a minute. Go on! Stomp on them! You've got... Right, guys, we're going to count to ten and see how many you can burst in ten seconds. Right. right, let's start from ten. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Wow, you girls are so good at this. Go on then. Max, you had not rough, no rough jumping. Iris, you are good at this. Go on. Ordinarily, last minute, I realised that Iris has what? What class have you got? Um, ballet and school. Not school. You're broken up from school now until September. Do you remember? Yeah. But you've got ballet. And it's the last one today. This is the last ballet for the summer too. So you're going to go there, have a really good dance. And then it's tennis. Yeah, tennis is on Saturday. But ballet will be finished for the summer. And then you'll go back when you go to school. Um, when is tennis going to be finished? I'm not sure. I was going to give them a ring because I'm not entirely sure if they break up or if they don't break up. So I'll give them a call and I'll let you know. Give us a twirl in your ballet costume. She looks so cute in it. Yeah. Woo! Are you going to do some good dancing? Yeah, we better go. 
Mum is so bad at timekeeping. Do you think so? Do you think Mummy's always late? Yeah, but Mummy. Yeah. Um, guess what? What? Once my once once on Monday, I was at school. The teacher was to say, "Yeah, you, you're on time." <laughs> Did you hear that guys? She came into school on time and her teacher was like, yay, you're on time. Like, I shouldn't laugh. I honestly try my hardest to get there on time. And in September, I am gonna try really hard to make sure that you are on time every single day, yeah? Pinky promise? Pinky promise. I think you need to do it like this actually. Pinky promise? Pinky promise. I'm gonna try really hard to make but sure mommy, you're not late because you're gonna be in big, mommy, big year one, yeah? Mummy. Yeah. It's the end of Ashcock I'm in year one now. I know. Right, let's go. Come on, out. Two hours later. How are you feeling? You hot? Shall I put your hair up for bed? <sighs> Shall I put it up? so hot. My neck. Yeah, that's how my hair feels. I will put it up for you. Guys, I managed to get my hair up into a tiny little ponytail because literally, I know it's short, but still making the nape of my neck so incredibly hot and sweaty. So I'm really glad that I managed to get it up. I am just going to put Iris to bed now, guys, and go and have a pep talk with my other guys. Oh dear. Yeah. We have just had a milk spillage. <laughs> um, let me show you. Show your foot. Oops, Oops daisies. daisies. We will get that cleaned up. So yeah, I'm just going to have a pep talk with my guys for tomorrow. That is Max, Jean and Elsie. They are starting Oliver rehearsals tomorrow. So that is super exciting. Um, not sure what Jude has planned. I think he will be going to the boxing gym because he didn't go today because he had a friend over and they spent all day doing God knows what. I actually don't even know. I'm gonna go and have a chat with him. I hope to see you all again tomorrow. Thank you so much for tuning into our videos. We appreciate it more than you will ever know. Good night, guys. Bye.